In this video, we're going to be taking a look at Twig blocks inside of Drupal 8. We're going to address the confusion if there is any between the Drupal blocks and the Twig blocks. We're going to learn what is actually a Twig block and where or in which template files is it used and how to use it properly. So here we have a Drupal instance installed and in Drupal blocks are basically as you go to structure and under block layout you see all the blocks that you have on the page and they are basically plugins that are assigned to specific regions so it could be a list created by views that could be represented as a block or different modules could have blocks and you could just place them on the page from here or your own module could declare a block and that's essentially the Drupal blocks basically everything on the page is a block for example these are blocks there is a block here for this menu or for the header area and for the content part okay so those are the Drupal 8 blocks and the Twig blocks the concept there is if we take a look at the documentation of Twig we see that the idea of blocks inside of Twig is that you could have a base template for example this template and inside of it with the help of the Twig block you could say from here to here I'm declaring a block called head and this is the content of a block and you could have as many blocks as you want and then you would have a child template that extends the base template for example this template is called base HTML tweak but for example you could have it called block HTML tweak for example or block HTML and then as you say that you're extending the base template you could simply just override the blocks for example here you're overwriting just the head block from the base block you're just overwriting this bit and this gets inherited into the child template just by using the extent and overwriting just the specific blocks inside of the child template and that's the general idea of the Twig blocks inside of Drupal 8 the Twig blocks are used in the Drupal blocks maybe there was an idea that it would be too confusing if you have on the page both Drupal blocks and Twig blocks and maybe they decided that just for the sake of not confusing the people dramatically we will just have the twig blocks inside of the Drupal blocks so for example let's have a look at this bit here the tools block and if we check at the markup we see that the markup comes from core teams Bartik template block system menu block HTML tweak let's go ahead and have a look at there so we have core teams Bartik templates and we have block system menu block and here as we saw in the example we see that what we are overwriting is a block from the classy team and this is the block that is being overridden and usually for example this one is the base template as we see here in the tweak the book this is usually the base template and then the others are the templates that are overwriting the base template just bits of the base template so as we see here we have some 
wrapper markups in the block HTML tweak, the equivalent of the base HTML in the tweak documentation. And we have some wrappers here and we have some blocks defined. And as we see in the children templates, it is they are just setting some variables and they are overwriting specific blocks. So let's go ahead and copy these three bodies into our own template that we have here. And let's just make a quick example with them. So here we are saying that we are overwriting the block HTML tweak. So let's see. We're having here a div and say this comes from base tweak template and close the div. The branding will delete because we don't need that. But here we would say that we are extending just the block HTML tweak that is coming from the current team. And we could say here our bit from the overwritten child template. Let's have it in a diff again. There we go. And if we clear the cache here, let's go ahead and do it quickly with the help of Devel. We will see that in our tools block, we should basically have the markup and the text that we had in our base template. So of course the stuff from the base template we have everywhere and our bit from the overwritten child template is just here or in the others that are using the same uh, block but from the base template we have it everywhere basically in every block that is using the base block so this is the general idea of the tweak blocks inside of Drupal 8. If you like this video, please check the links in the description, like, subscribe, and thanks for watching.